Alfred, and uh, it's been a while, a long while, since I recorded anything. Um, but hey, welcome back to Friday Night Roguelikes. This is Kingdom of Roguing. This is uh, a loath style roguelite, rogue time, loath blart, a loathing roguelike. It's uh, set in the same universe as Kingdom of Loathing, which I played a lot of. So, you are Friedrich Reed. Hey, that's pretty fitting. Today's your big day. Today's the day you start adventure or college. Not as simple as showing up. The journey to school doubles as your entrance exam. The more swagger you earn on the way, the less tuition you'll charge, so it's critical you travel as dangerously as possible. Where are you from, Friedrich? Oh, I'm from wherever. Okay. Adventure College allows you to take one magic item with you. You look over your meager collection of enchanted trinkets. What would you want? Grandpa's ring. And your trusty familiar. Uh-huh. Um... Losing combat ends your run, but 20% boost all swagger earned. I'll say no for now. Disco face stab. Better than nothing. I got a shrimp fork. Which road are we hitting? Let's go for a mansion. Oh. Chateau Ravendark. So. This is a... Uh, Obviously based off of Kingdom of Loathing, but it is also based off of, more heavily off of, uh, West of Loathing. Um, a game that, uh, oh yeah, huh, it still has the cowboy hat, even though that's, uh, <laughs> interesting. Cool. Cool. That's all that does, I guess. Your gear. It's very obviously uh, still using all of West of Loathing stuff. But yeah, this is based off of the uh, Porquoise Ring. Increases Moxie. Nice. Oh. This is a tiny being. This is the tiny being's ring from, from Dark Souls. The tiny being's ring increases your health by a very small amount. This is a ring your grandfather got from a tiny being and then gave it to you because it's almost worthless. It's funny. Nice. So, uh, yeah, it's been um, a couple of weeks since I actually recorded anything. I was content with streaming, and then uh, I took a break of streaming. Ugh. The liquid inside the pot is not tea, if it ever was. <laughs> nice. I had initially intended to upload this right after I had finished Kingdom of Loathing. Scotch Martini, nice. That kid could do that, yeah. Oh, yes, it can, because it's a... Oh, thanks. Nice. Can't go to expired, but you spent a few minutes making it the labels face the same way. Oh, goofballs. And a skeleton key. And a bottle of poison. Neat. Cool. Oh, neat. <laughs> nice. Pink filter. 
So yeah, um, some more lore on this game. This was created with a. Uh... Oh, there was a thing I should use the skeleton key on. Well, truthfully, not really should or shouldn't, just can. Nine, nice. Ito. There's a weekly or a yearly rather challenge to create a roguelike in one week. Middle-aged man with a black hood taps you on the shoulder. Head for Adventure College, huh? This will help. Secret Society ring. Thanks, but the man is already gone. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Where to next? Cave. Ooh, big boys. Oh, he's dead. Oh boy, this isn't good. Is it? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's nice. He's bleeding. Oh, this is going to kill me. Damn. They stole my meat and they lost my XP. Fuck, wow. Nice. So you can end up getting pretty fucked over, huh? Ealing ointment and goofballs. Is there supposed to be music? My audio is up. So I guess I would hear music if there was any. Yeah, so this is the first time I'm actually recording a, a, a roguelike in a while. Or anything, as I mentioned. Nice. That's a lot better. Hmm. Let's just do one of these, huh? Damn. Grusador the mosquito, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. He's only going to lose... Hmm. Do that. <laughs> I love this game's animations. Let's work on this fella, huh? Uh, that might not be. Yeah, it wasn't. Fuck. Dang, indeed. This game's pretty hard. Sure, metal bits. Neat. That is Nito Brito. So I guess I was just randomly given this class. Because normally I would like... Nice. Normally I would get a choice of like... Ooh, a puce filter. Blech. Normally you'd get a choice between like the three. Let's see what that is actually. Nice. Oh yeah, can I equip any? Let's not do that. Let's just put this back on. Mysticality. Oh my god, that's terrible. So maybe it's like based off of just what weapons you have. Effervescent dark green. Goofballs. Nice. Man.
let's try this. All right. So I'm going to try a different technique here. Much better. Much better damage. Jesus. Oh, he tossed a taco. That mosquito is more of a, like a like a meat shield. <laughs> it says clonk. Oh yeah, I can just stack it on everyone. I I've been playing poorly, on fact. Oh, he's stacking fire on me. Well, that isn't good. Well, let's see here. This might win me my first cave fight. Nice. Fungal goo. Recall that from Loathing, all goblins are actually made of fungus. Um, because of this game's like fast and loose way of dealing with combat. Oh, yeah, yeah, that reminds me. The way, the re the way that I've been losing XP is pretty dumb, but... Nice, ripped abs. Yeah. Let's take a look at my character now. Three muscle. Nice. This is a pretty classic roguelike. As you're leaving Active Door Cabin, you notice a town. Let's go. Bodyguards for hire. Body shop. Uh, all right. Foodstuffs. Combat items. Hattery. Get thee to a hattery. <laughs> That's clever. Oh, so this is just random. And these are, I imagine, also random. Let me see here. What will give me muscle? That gives me three. Really stacking me up here. All right. Pretty doodad. These are kind of uh, better. But uh, I don't really like using goofballs. Just in this game or in general. Gives me armor, hot armor, and spooky armor. Hmm. Oh yeah, I can sell my old weapon. Hmm. Let me see here. This one's kind of the best. Let's keep selling. All right. Don't really know if I want this secret society ring. And does this place sell? It doesn't sell pants. Combat items and food. Oh yeah, because the so normally in Kingdom of Loathing you have your daily am amount of stomach that you can eat. Oh nice, Grusadora. Where to next? Well, let's go to the cemetery. Hit him with my bone. Had too many martinis. Doug Peterson, Cosmopolitans, Gimlets. Both Henderson. Nice. At least two demons, huh? These guys are tough. Ooh, nice. That's pretty useful. Whoa, seven bleeding. That's kind of ridiculous. 
That's AoE damage. Jesus. Let's bleed him. And then let's... Oh, shit. That was the wrong person. I was going to try to bonk the skull because I would kill him in one. And I don't think that'll help me. Yeah, I'm dead. Woof. Nice. Damn. Oh, so it's just random. Okay, that's kind of clever. Just like, do you have enough of this stuff? Well, you should take it. Yeah. It's kind of nice. One muscle, XP, strong bones, thick skin. I've got 31. Oh, that's kind of cool. And I'll get that one. But it's usually pretty useful. It appears to be useful just to try to max out your stuff. Damn. I'll help you later, Doug. All right, let's hope this works. Okay. And then we bonk him. And now he will not hurt me anymore. Nice. And he didn't bleed me, which is good. See, so because of the way that this game works, you can just keep stacking stuff on people. Which is kind of cool. So you, yeah, that guy now has two ranks of bleeding. Sorry, I'm trying to select this other dude. Okay, you can just click on him. Hecate the Jabby Demon. Oh boy. Hmm. Not sure if this will actually kill. But maybe I'll get some XP for it? Or no, I think XP is only added up at the end of battle. No. Ah, oh, well. Luckily, I had no XP. Nice. Oops. So yeah, I had actually intended to play this right after... Um, Beating the original Kingdom of Loathing. Good balls, nice. Um, however, I just got like busy and didn't. So yeah, I. Uh... Yeah, this was supposed to come out on Christmas. This episode, and there were supposed to be a few other episodes scattered throughout uh, January. The earlier parts of January, that is. Wow, that's it? This is a pathetic cave. Or mausoleum. Clifford Bennett. Too many Manhattans. Takiris. Cerebral palsy. Ring is zooming, huh? Act earlier in combat. Interesting. I still want to have um, the health, though. Let me see here. Yeah, let's do one of those, huh?
All right, I might just die against him, and I want to avoid that. So let's get some of that, huh? More ex, more, uh, more stuff. Okay. Nice. And then I will bonk him. And now I only have to survive two turns. Okay, I picked a good guy to start zeroing in on. Oh boy. Okay. Rahu the Jabby Demon. And then, so that'll kill him. That'll kill him dead. Because he'll ble Yeah, there you go. There you go. And then he heals me. Oh, boy. Okay. So... Yeah, we can just bonk him, right? Bip. And then he dies. Cool. Nice and easy. Excellent. That is indeed excellent. Oh, huh. Thanks, Bones. Thank you, Bones. This is a very simple game. Um... Museum War, Slab of Reindeer, Tolmeria, Duck Steak, Chicken Haunch. Uh, let's see if I can't. Well, I can't. Oh, brother in law just left for work. Oh, yeah, so I had a whole bunch of nightmares. Cool looking bird. That's it. Doesn't mention, doesn't change your stats or anything you thought was worth mentioning. Good bird, got it. Let's go to the Gulch. This game is technically free. Um, it's pay what you want. Cries bombs. Nice. Yeah, this is a pay what you want game. Um, I hopefully have supported the developers. Ooh, a new hat. It is identical crap nice sorry I'm trying to think but nothing's happening I've been in here right 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 let's tussle skeleton Oh, Jesus. Well, let's see about that, huh? Let's cure that poisson. Can I bleed a skeleton? I guess it wouldn't make that much sense. See, these probably can't bleed, can't. Okay, then. I was kind of expecting skeletons to not be able to bleed on account of them not having blood. But, uh, yeah, I guess not. Thanks, Grusadora. I'm very glad I healed them. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I just gotta focus on one. Whittle them down. Oh man, that's not great. Let's take some goofballs. Let's take some items. Uh, 
I'm really, really, really trying to survive here. Oh, bleed for four. That's kind of neat. Oh, wow, you can just keep using these, huh? That reminds me, I can just... I've realized I can just keep using these, too. I had no idea. Wow, I kind of wasted part of my turn there. That's cool. <laughs> nice. Oh, man. Oh, this is going to suck. It did suck, yeah. Let's do one of those, huh? See, unfortunately, I don't have any of my big cool items. I also don't know if I have much of a chance to, like, survive. <laughs> it just kicks me. It's funny. Oh, thank you. You'll heal me. So does poison just take effect later? Or no, poison already took effect. Duh. Oh my god. Shit, man. See, I'm going to play until I run out of things. If that gives me four new options to pick from, then I will go somewhere else. Nice. Nice. See, unfortunately, I don't appear to be able to do anything with those. But yeah, so very, very simplified game. It automatically refills you after you... Yeah. Like, after you leave the fight. Every fight is its own thing. Okay, cool. Sorry. I'm trying to think, but nothing happened. But yeah, I intend to do a full LP of West of Loathing itself as well. Um. <laughs> the concept of like smelting ore with your body heat's really funny. But yeah, so as for what's been going on, uh, I woke up and I had slept uh, real poorly. Oh, fuck. Should I have been... Fuck. Oh, can we just... Wait, so should there be music? I'm recording this, right? Bip, bip, bip. One moment, everyone. Hey, everything's fine. I just died, though. I don't have any XP, do I? Oh, fuck, I do. It means I should have been buying shit. That was stupid of me. Let's head on. Cakeville, huh? Okay, let's take a look around first. Potion shop. Hattery. Oh, yeah, let's sell my extra hat. It sells for 30. These appear to all be as good as the other. I don't really care about that. Cool. Weapon shop. Perfect. All right. Muscle and hot damage. That's pretty great. All right. Muscle plus three. Muscle plus five. Wow. Wow. That's a that's a step up. Let's sell that leg bone. 
And then I guess let's buy a whole bunch of tattoos. Because I really like... Dirty Swagger. Dirty Swagger. Dirty Swagger. Okay, cool. With the leftovers, let's see if we can just get some miscellaneous shit. I've already drunk something, actually. I actually, yeah, I've already drunk something. I forget what Swagger does. I have um, seen all of West of Loathing, but I've not played it for myself. One place between you and Adventures College. Adventures. Creepy Wizard's Tower. Walrus Kick. Cool. Spaghetti Spear. Let's flip it. Nice. So now I have Walrus Kick. Oh, cool. Reduce your enemy stats by your muscle. That's great. The mysticality. Okay, so now I have all three of those. So yeah, this game, if you wish to play it, is uh, free. So tricky, it's actually three vampires. Okay, so. Gabriel Dark Bluster. Oh, yeah, sorry. I set the speed up because I was just looking at stuff. You can turn this down. Sorry, that's what they're supposed to be. Ramus Nightstein. Drake Gray Murder. Oh, you can see that they're targeting my little guy. Hmm. Probably got a lot of blood, huh? <coughs> Sorry, everyone. My damage is pretty great. Oh, he keeps reducing my stats. I was like, actually, the damage wasn't that actually not as good. And in fact, it was. Let's put another tier of bleed on him. And then kill him, I guess. Yeah, the fact that they keep reducing my stats is really annoying. <laughs> Although I don't think that he can go any lower. <laughs> and how much do you have? Four. Well, let's start working on you then, huh? Got some macaroni and cheese in the fridge. I mean, it, uh, that could have been better. So they don't actually do a whole lot of damage to me. Using all stats by one and dealing one damage. Oh, this is the same. That's a, that's okay, I guess. I should probably stack up on this guy. Let's heal myself. And then let's beat him with a stick. <laughs> Please, I can't lose any more. I can't possibly lose any more. <laughs> okay. So he's got four ranks of bleeding on him, I think. So I'm going to have to keep just pounding away at him. That might kill him, though. There you go. 
And now this is just a DPS race. Where he'll keep stacking up more and more each time. Yeah. Yeah. And now he's dead. Need a burrito. Not so bad. Nice. Intriguing. Really makes you think. Really makes you think. You're not sure what they were going for. We've only got 40 meat. Yeah, so I've been doing a lot of... Um, yeah, I've been doing streaming. Bubbly Potion. Neat. Really makes you think. But yeah, I've been doing a lot of streaming. I like streaming. Um, it's just that like it's kind of difficult and disheartening to get started. Uh, let's read another book. Claws of the Shrew. Poison equal to muscle. Oh, it's from the Frigid Northlands. I kind of want to play another Frigid Northlands character, but like I know they're very, very like generic. All right, let's see here. Four poison. That's really great. What the hell is this thing? Polter toast. <laughs> All right, he's got four rings of poison on him now. Let's kill this just so it doesn't even have a chance to do anything. There you go. Um, hmm. How about another four ranks of poison, my good man? And then if I hit him, I'll deal nine damage. I don't know how. Let's start working on the other ones. Malachi Jake Blade, Gabriel Drake Bluster. You see, the thing is, they don't do a whole lot of damage. Um, hmm. Oh, right. Now the poison is just equivalent to whatever. Ah, oh, well. It's kind of interesting. All this really makes me want to do is play West of Loathing. A feeling I've had a lot, actually. Okay, so he'll die in one turn. I'll just kill him. Now he'll die in one turn as well. Then he'll take one damage in one turn. Cool, perfect. Just bumped my microphone. Sorry, excuse me, everyone. My B... But yeah, the interesting way that this game handles stats is actually pretty cool. Like where stats are just your stats. Thwack him. And like no matter what, you just have... The way that it resets every after every battle is nice. Dark Filter. Cloudy Brew. Intriguing. Still not wearing pants. I forget what I had, actually. It's kind of annoying. Does it say? Poison equal to muscle is pretty fantastic. Oh, yeah. How much XP do I have? Cool. That's what I wanted. I might actually play this game some more. Maybe I'll do a second part. Although I might have to add some music because uh, Colonel Bosofen's Tower. Been in here. Fuck. 
I might have to add some music just because it's a little blee. Isn't there supposed to be music? Like, it's not showing any. Combat sound is on. Did I just destroy everything? I did destroy everything. Fuck. One moment, everyone. Hey, and I'm back. Um, so yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I fucking destroyed it by accident. Let me fix that. Um, so yeah, I actually have enough to get this now. I increased, uh, Oh, interesting, huh? Can ghosts bleed? Yeah, cool. So yeah, now these guys, so I have walrus kick and disco face stab and I actually boosted my moxie. And I also have, um, nice. I also now have this buddy on my side. Thank you. Um, Can I select this guy? There you go. S three spooky damage and reducing mysticality by three. Nice. <laughs> the boost to Moxie is really, really good. Thank you. Perfect. See, so yeah, getting buddies on your side is actually pretty useful. Narrow gadget, huh? Yeah, so I have a really good armor or accessory, so I don't really need that. Uh, I'll get more Moxie. Let's read a book. Spaghetti Spear. Damn. Because I already have this, bleeding equal to Moxie. This is physical damage equal to mysticality. And then reduce all enemy stats by my muscle. So yeah, my stats are a lot more spread out. But yeah, um, I learned that this lasts until the next area. Cool. But yeah, this lasts until the next area or until you drink something else. I had just forgotten that it was there. Bacon stone ring. Ring of telling skeletons what to do. <laughs> Hold on. You can always tell skeletons what to do, but with this ring, you have to they have to listen. And then the bacon stone ring increases mysticality each round of combat. Uh, and the shrimp fork deals mysticality plus two physical damage. So this initially just does four damage, and then next turn it does five, and that keeps going up. Uh, I have that because I do not have a... Let me see here. Oh, yeah. I can just do both of them. Perfect. Uh, he still does four bleeding. They both do four bleeding. Shit. Uh, I'll do that. And then I'll... I'll hit this one to just work on damaging him more. Uh, oh, that's perfect, actually. He is now much less of a problem. I will bleed him. Wow, bleed does a lot. I should really remember that my bleed does so much more than I think it does. Like, my ability to bleed dudes is really high. I should really keep that in mind. <laughs> All turkey hot dog. Slap but feel. And a rack of beef. 
Oh, Moxie by one. Neat. I certainly do. Um, I'll put this on for now. Nice. Then I'll swap that out. So you can just see your active effects down there. Very, very simple. Like, it's a very easy game to pick up. I highly recommend that people should... Ah, oh, fuck. Cyan Fluid. I highly recommend people play this. This is a very good game. Oh, nice. Let's go to the cemetery. Toxic Shock Syndrome. Oh, boy. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, a skeleton key. Great. That would have been useful ten, like 10 seconds ago. Um, wow, that's a... Uh, um, let's see here. 10 physical damage. 10 hot damage and sets them on fire. Wow, that's got to be stopped. Uh, I guess let's just round it out. Oh, fuck, but I... I do so much bleed that I should really, uh, see, I haven't died yet. Oh man, I guess you can't heal him, huh? I don't even know how much bleed that is. Thank you. Perfect. Nice. Oh, yeah, let's spend some XP because I've got some now, huh? More AP. That's cool. Good listener. Oh, plus one of familiar stats. That's useful too. Moxie has some Moxie actually has some pretty useful stuff in it, which I really dig. Hmm. Oh yeah, I didn't even It's the first ghost I've encountered. This is a really cool game. It is a very well-made, very simple roguelike. I feel like part of that is because, like, they did a lot of cool stuff with the engine. Let's see here. Um, let's reduce your stats. Let's reduce your stats. That stacks some bleed on you. Um, hmm. This is more dangerous. In fact, I probably should have bled him. Reducing mysticality. That's cool, actually. Five bleed. That might just kill him. Nice. Cool. Is there a maximum bleed you can stack up on someone? Because, like, I actually love bleed builds. In Dark Souls 3, you used to be able to have a... There was a really nice bleed build that you can't really do anymore. And, like, it's really unfortunate. Because, like, it was a really cool... Um... Oh, cool. It was a really cool build, but they nerfed the hell out of it. And, like, it's kind of just unfortunate. You have two already. Cool gas mask. Let's see. Oh, weapon shop. Cool. Uh, Moxie plus spooky. Oh, cool. I like that. All right, let's respec. Put that on. Now this, I don't need to up my mysticality, so. Uh, hmm. I put this old ring back on. And then let's sell these. Don't really. 
I don't know why it says I have this equipped. I don't. And if I actually did have it equipped, it would say like, hey, do you, are you sure? Like that. That's a pretty good thing. Ah, uh, yeah, right. Okay, cool. Let's see. I've got 31 XP. Three hot armor. Interesting. Winning smile. Excellent answer. Uh, let's add that. And let's get more meat. I assume that it'll like... Oh, cool. I should have clicked on that earlier. Nice. Let's just sell the generic ones. Like there aren't even that many areas left. I just want to get to the next. I want to get another tattoo. Nice. Cool. Um, I'm getting close to the end, so. Oh, useful. Wizard Tower. Readings for nerds. Okay, so we got a vampire. Oh, geez. Fweet. <laughs> uh, six bleed. Yeah, let's just bleed them all. That's freedom. Nice. Um, hmm. One spooky damage. See, you've got a lot of it, so it'd be good to reduce your spook damage. Cool. <laughs> nice much better let's see if we can't buy something strong bones oh more health that's useful double ryan root beer i don't even have seven wow i'm short by one. Oh yeah yeah i can drink something now let's do that moxie nice muscle mysticality Moxie. Nice. Cool. Brilliant blue potion. This is a very, very... Like, again, I feel like a lot of it is just uh, how well the engine is. And I do play a lot of free games, so I do, like, have a lot of experience in, like, what you would typically get out of a solid free game extra blood um oh yeah this that'll be good then how much do i have i have 25 swole delts hot armor will that give me enough spooky armor to do that thing fuck ah well Stack some bleeds on. Eight bleed. God damn. And those guys, I remember that they're not actually that solid. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, that bleed isn't good. Um, hmm. Oh, yeah, I'm Robert Perez now. I'm not sure if I'll survive. I don't even know how much bleed is on me. 
Why not, huh? Oh my god. Twenty eight. <laughs> I love bleed builds. Uh, you might have actually seen since I was streaming earlier, but the way that bleed works in Dark Souls is one of my favorite ways that like bleed works. Um as you fight, you build up the bleed meter. If you fill the bleed meter up, then they take um, however much bleed damage they would take, I guess. So I'm hoping that this has a good boss fight because that's what I really want in a roguelike. I want a good fucking boss fight, you know? Eight bleed. Eight bleed. Eight bleed. It's a shame he can't heal uh, my other guys. All right. Thank you, Westina. Oh shit. <laughs> that uh that was more luck than skill. I kinda I kinda screwed that one up a little bit. But hey, we've got a winning smile now. Oh. Huh. Alright. Uh I got that much swagger. Cool. Cool. Done Baskin. So that's um, Kingdom of Roguing. It's uh, very simple. Very good, though. Um, again, I feel like that is to the credit of the excellent engine, which did already exist uh, because of Kingdom of Roguing. But it's very, very good, regardless. Um, this game is free. You can play it yourself if you like. Uh, and I recommend you do. I might actually play more after this. Um, yeah, I've been Alfred. This has been Friday Night Roguelikes. And we're coming up on the end of it. I said that it would end before January, but I lied. Uh, and it's going to end whenever I'm out of roguelikes. So, see you guys later. Bye. <laughs>